Hey guys, this is Rob with Waymakers Lawn Care. How's everybody doing today? Hey, uh, I'm here at the uh, Acme Mowing headquarters. Uh, I am painting this wall right here. <clears throat> Put a first coat on it uh, last night or yesterday afternoon. And uh, I, I don't know if it's going to need another coat or not. It might. But uh, I got to do the stairs, get a coat of paint on the stairs, and uh, probably probably gonna go ahead and paint these this trim. Um, I'm just gonna probably just go ahead and paint it gray to match uh, the rest, cause it kind of just sticks out, and I don't like it. It just don't look very good. Uh, so I'm gonna probably paint that. And then I know I have to paint uh, this right here. Um, so, Ben said not not to do the stair part, but I am going to do the the rails and and all that. Uh, so, paint that. Now I got a spot up there. I got to cut in some spots upper in the corner um but yeah guys this is what i'm doing um i started it yesterday and i'll have it finished by today so um originally if you was painting inside of a house you know you'd caulk all this stuff right here all this right here you'd caulk all that but uh, you start caulking and you're not going to stop because you got all the lines where they meet together uh, you'd have to caulk all that uh, so I'm not doing that so if anybody wants to say hey you didn't caulk anything well you're right I didn't because you have all this up here to caulk You'd have all that, you'd have that. You'd have, there's a big old crack right across there. It's a big old gap, probably an inch gap at the very top. So then you'd have to caulk all this stuff, all the railing. And I, I just, for a shop, I think it's gonna, uh, not gonna matter. Um, it's not that I ain't taking pride in my work, but uh, just you'd have to caulk all the corners I mean Ben's not wanna gonna want to do all that that's have me do all that that's a lot of work uh, be a lot more time which would be a lot more money so um, but anyways in a in a house guys you'd you'd tape all this stuff off and and, and put caulk down there and and caulk all that stuff and and but we're not going to be doing that so but that's what i'm uh i'm doing today and that's what i did yesterday and so i sure appreciate being in kh letting me do this because things have been a little slow around the house no work um and that's one thing, guys. I was, um, was talking to Ben yesterday. You know, it's like, you know, when you go and go for a full time job all your life, and lawn care is your oh your your part time job, then you're used to having your part time job as your fun money and and doing this and that. Well. Um, I'm having to learn um, to put back save and I'm learning I'm going into my fifth season um, but 2020 hit us pretty hard uh, with you know just just life and things that just kept on breaking down and it just took our took what we had every bit we had you know truck breakdown you know guys that was a that was a lot of money uh, 
the money that everything broke down with. We had an AC go out in our house, uh, hot water tank go out. Um, we just had a lot of setbacks this year, and it just just uh, took everything we had. And so when things like that hit us, it just, it, you know, you struggle. So, um, guys, you know, when you're learn, I mean, when you're going up there and you're going full time in this, make sure you set back stuff. Um, and I know things do happen, but, uh, set back and I am learning, I am learning that. Um, uh, so anyways, uh, that's just a little piece of advice for the people that's wanting to go full time in this. Make sure you have enough to keep you going and you set back money for the, the winter months and the off season. Um, so if you do get that job, uh, like maybe you get an extra little cleanup job or whatever during the winter time or off season, then, you know, that's just a, a blessing. But uh, just set back, guys. I don't know if this makes any sense to you. I hope it hope it does, but it's something that I am learning. So um, I'm gonna put you on time lapse of what I'm doing and uh, today, and uh, we're just gonna go from there. So here we go, guys. Okay, guys, put you on time lapse. You get the, that's what I'm gonna be doing. Uh, that's how I'm gonna be rolling it, as y'all can see. Um, this right here is uh, actually called, people do, call it different things. Uh, I call it a weenie roller. Uh, some people call it a hot dog roller. Some people call it something else. I forgot the name of it, but what else they call it but there's a there's a few things that they call that kind of roller uh and it's real good to get behind uh toilets uh railing like this uh, instead of brushing every bit of it um that is the tool to use right there um so that's that's what i'm going to do this is how i'm going to do it uh it shouldn't take very much longer um probably have to put a second coat on this um this one don't look too bad the wall uh i could probably run it over with the second coat but uh and it probably does need it but what i'm gonna do is and it won't take as long as it did the first time second coat is just to get it on there <clears throat> so uh i'll probably put a second coat on this a coat on that that trim um I, you know guys i thought about doing white trim i think that would look good but i don't want to go buy a gallon of paint 
just to do trim and, and paint just be sitting around. So uh, Ben decides he wants to do white after I do the gray, then uh, I'll paint it, come back and paint it white for him. But um, that's what I'm doing today, guys. And when I get done with this, I should be done by today. Uh, then I will show y'all the after effects. Um, so I'm using a two and a half gallon, um, uh, bucket right there. Um, a little screen. <clears throat> so guys, I'll, I'll, uh, show you the after effects. I'll get through with this. Uh, this little ladder here. Let me show you my little ladder. Let me show you this, guys. I'm kind of proud of it. It's called the Little Giant. Uh, they have the Little Giant that's pretty big, and I have it also. I really don't like it, but this one I love. Uh, I could make it a six-foot ladder. I can make it an extension ladder. It'll reach up there. Uh, it'll get me high enough where I need to reach. Um, so you've got two ladders and one, and I really like this. I, I bought it when we started doing the, the tree cleanups and stuff. Um, I think we use it once or so, once or so. I'm not sure. Uh, but I got it from Lowe's. But I like the little ladder. I mean, it's working pretty good. Uh, you know, I feel safe on it. Um, it'll hold a fat boy. So that's all that matters. But then there's my bag all my stuff in um you know i've got my drywall stuff in there uh, anything to do drywall with sand sand pads and, you know i've got uh everything to paint with uh tools wise is in there and that is the c l c bag man i really like it Matter of fact, I have this one and another one, and then I have the smaller version at home. So, uh, that's how much I like it. So, just just showing you my tools a little bit, guys. Uh, but anyways, I'm gonna get on this and get at least the one coat on there and let it hurry up and dry. Uh, and then probably second coat the wall after I get through with uh, the stairs and let the stairs dry time it's kind of chilly this morning it's supposed to warm up to about 50 or so um, the time I get through with the wall and, and redoing it uh, the stairs should dry and then I should be able to put another coat on the stairs and um, it should be done um, and then I'll probably have to get a coat on the, the trim before I start the walls, um, which is not a big thing, not a big deal. Um, make sure you you mask off your put plastic over the windows. That way, when you do roll, uh, there's no splatters or nothing that gets on the the window itself. Um, so, guys, I'll show you the after effects. Uh, I'm gonna hurry up and get off of here before I can hurry up and get this done, and. I'll be back. Okay, guys. Uh, here's the finished product. Uh, just waiting on Ben to come look at it. Um, so I still haven't cleaned up my mess, but this is it. This is what it turned out to look like. Went ahead and painted the uh, trim, just gray. Uh, so that's it. And the stairs. He said not to do the steps and stuff, so I don't know if he wants this done. That's why I kind of left it out, but if he does, it'll take a few minutes. I'll do that. It won't be no big deal. So, this is it, guys. And he'll hang his posters back up and his flag, his American flag. And, uh, but it's still wet. Uh, just put the second coat on it. But... All right, guys, I'm going to end this video, and uh, as always, 
be good and treat people right and have a good day.